in this lecture we will talk about the next principle of scamper called as eliminate this is in fact one of the easiest principles to understand but the most difficult to apply over a period of time our products services processes and even our lifestyle assimilates so many unnecessary things or what we call as non value adds eliminating them can drastically change the status quo this example narrates how rubber tires used in locomotives have been completely eliminated benefits of this elimination include reduced cost improved performance faster turnaround time to repair the punctured tires conventional tires needed rubber tubes to be fitted inside them to inflate them traditionally the tires that we use aren't leak proof and the rubber tubes weren't hard enough to withstand the wear and tear so we needed both the tire and the tube tubeless tires made this possible because they are tight enough to hold the air and at the same time they are hard enough to withstand the wear and tear thereby they eliminated the tube altogether or i could say they eliminated the tire altogether this has been made possible because of an improved design and a manufacturing process which is very unique so you would appreciate that it's very easy to say just go and eliminate but eliminating something might mean we have to do fundamental research and change a lot of things in our processes now we'll talk about some tips relating to manufacturing what parts can be cut out what would happen if we can remove any random part from an assembly what operation or which operation or steps don't change the output in the service sector we could ask questions such as what are the tasks that don't have any bearing on the outcome very similar to the earlier one which are the tasks for which our customer is not willing to pay for we could eliminate those from a strategic and leadership perspective what if the budgets didn't exist at the current levels what if this resource or this employee or this department in fact did not exist which product or services can we eliminate and still hit our revenue target can some policies be eliminated can some approvals be eliminated asking these questions would trigger us to find out different ways of working with that i'm going to wrap up this lecture see you in the next